Hey UVAC friends, my name is Hannah. I'm a new personal trainer here at UVAC. Um, so there's a slight schedule change to this How To With Hannah segment. Um, I'm going to be on Facebook Live every Wednesday at 6.15 instead of 5 o'clock, which is what I've done the past couple weeks. So 6.15, Facebook Live, How To With Hannah. Um, so every week I will talk about a new exercise and I'll focus on proper form, what muscles, the exercise works, that kind of thing. So for this week we're talking about lunges. Um, there are quite a few different variations, so for today I'm just going to stick with the basics. I'm just going to do forward lunges, reverse lunges. So lunges are mostly a lower body exercise. It's going to work your quads, glutes, hips, hamstrings, and as always, with proper form, it's going to work your core. Um, it's also great for stability work because you will be moving while standing on one foot. So it's going to work um, those muscles. And similar to squats, which I talked about last week, it's a great functional movement, um, which means it mimics things you do every day, like tying down or bending down to tie your shoe. For example, so the more you can strengthen these muscles, just the better you can function and move in your day to day. Um, all right, so we can talk about form. For a lunge, you're gonna start with your feet about hip width apart. You wanna try to remember to keep your chest up throughout the movement, engage your core. This is gonna be a common theme. Um, and then for this one, we're going to start with your right foot. So step your right foot forward Try to have your heel hit the ground first and then flatten out and then you will lower your body until your right thigh is parallel to the floor and your right shin is vertical. Um, try not to have your knee past your toes. Um, you might need to try it a couple times to get your step big enough. That's fine. Just practice it and make sure you get that step right. Um, and if possible, tap your left knee to the floor. And then when you come back up, you want to drive through your right heel, so your front foot, your front heel, back up to standing. And then you'll switch sides. So, looks like this. Feet hip width apart. You're going to step with your right foot. Try to get your heel to hit first. Down. Push back up. You can switch sides push back up. <clears throat> um, make sure you're doing the same amount on each leg. Uh, you could do, if you're doing a set of 10 for example, you could do five on your right side and then five on your left, or you can alternate either other, every other, sorry, um, whatever is more comfortable for you. You can also turn these into walking lunges, so you can um, alternate right and left. And instead of returning back to your starting position, you're going to shift your weight forward and you're going to step your back foot to meet your front foot. And then you can step forward to the opposite so you can move across the distance. Um, looks like this. I don't have a lot of room to show you, but you can do them as walking steps. Um, reverse lunges are exactly what they sound like. So you're going to start the same way, fit feet hip width apart, engage your core, and then you'll be taking a big step backwards with, let's start with your right foot. And then you will lower your body until your left thigh is parallel to the ground and your left shin is vertical. Sorry, to make sure I had my sides right. Um, and then you will tap your right knee to the floor if you can. Make sure it's very controlled. You don't want to be driving your knee into the floor. Um, and then you will push through your left heel back to standing. So, feet hip width apart. Let's step back, come back forward. Definitely engage your core and focus. It is very hard to be off balance, but the more you use your core, the easier it'll be. Um, 
Also, try to keep your feet hip width apart throughout the entire movement. Make sure the foot you're moving doesn't come too close to your center. You might lose balance. Um, so, like I mentioned earlier, there are many other variations to lunges, so I'll probably revisit those in a future video. Um, if there are any specific ones that you want to learn more about, let me know. Or if it's not a lunge variation and it's a completely different exercise, I'd also love to hear from you. So just let me know. I'll put it on my schedule. I'll make sure I talk about it in a future week. Um, so that's it for today's how to lunge. Um, remember these are now 6.15 on Wednesdays and I will see you next week.